And now we work with your workbooks. Please open your workbooks to the page number 62. Page number 62. Well, on this page, we have the title of the unit 11. They say, I can do that. We have checked this before. Now here, in this part, we have can and can't. Don't forget the pronunciation of the letter T because this is the only one difference between the affirmative and the negative form. If you say can in negative, this is incorrect. So don't forget the pronunciation of the letter T. Practice this sound. T, t. Y no están escupiendo por si acaso. Pónganse una hoja delante para probar si les sale la pronunciación. Okay, now here. They say write what the people can do. Choose a line from the box. We have some vocabulary. Ride a horse es montar caballo, por si acaso. Eh, manejar bicicleta o montar bicicleta. Ski, esquiar. And the other ones you already know. So according to the pictures, here you are going to complete the sentences with the activities that the people can do. For example, here, number one, Laura, she is Laura, can cook. All the sentences in affirmative form, just in case, por si acaso, everything in affirmative form. Don't forget that you don't have to change the verb. No cambien el verbo, solo el auxiliar y la expresión de aquí, sin cambiar el verbo. Ok, make a pause, hagan una pausa. Bueno, seguimos en el siguiente video.